Ross Bob Squirrel put out a glitch recently that shows how you can heal while going through a portal. After further testing, it turns out that this glitch has unlimited potential for what it can do. I feel like it's already turned into 100 glitches. So in this video, I'll be showing you everything I've learned about this glitch and everything you can do with it. First, let's talk about the setup. You'll need to have two weapons, one with an attachment on it, and an open spot in your inventory. The weapon with the attachment needs to be equipped. Now climb onto a ledge and hold. Now enter your inventory, remove the attachment from the weapon, then drop that weapon. Now exit your inventory and climb over the ledge. From here, you need either a charge tower or a downed teammate. Start activating the charge tower. Continue holding it while you access your inventory and select your other weapon to pull it out. If you can shoot while you continue to charge the charge tower, that means the glitch is active. The process is the same with the downed teammate, where you start the revive, enter your inventory, select the other weapon, and then shoot to test to make sure the glitch is active. Now let's list out the weird things that you can pull off with this glitch. If you get bored with one of these, just go ahead and skip to the next chapter where I'll cover a new trick. You can slightly mod your emotes depending on the legend you select. Start your emote and then pull out your tactical or ultimate. A lot of the tacticals and ultimates will show up in the hand or pocket of the character during the emote. With two-handed abilities like Pathfinder's Zipline or Seer's Tactical, it will actually cause the character's arms to stay close to his body instead of performing the normal actions of the emote. If you fly with this glitch active, your gun will show up on your crotch. Some Legends ultimates will also show up during the flight if you have them pulled out before initiating the flight and they will stay visible during your skydive emotes. When you're flying and you get close to the ground, you enter this landing animation. Once that animation is active, you can actually shoot almost immediately or use a tactical or ultimate. If you're Pathfinder, you can grapple as many times as you want mid-flight. If you're respawn with this glitch active, you can actually punch- You can melee in the dropship! Respawn ship. Oh. Ross already covered this, but if you start reviving a teammate and immediately pull out your Valkyrie ultimate, when you finish the revive, or if you cancel it, you'll enter this floating Valkyrie mode where you hover across the map at high speeds. On Stormpoint, you can hit gravity cannons while in this glitched Valk mode and get some crazy momentum. If yeah. you attach yourself to the Valk ult and then get kicked off, you actually won't be able to fly for the rest of the match. I can't fly anymore. And last and most important, I want to bring up the fact that you can pull off some insane trick shots right now with the glitches that are available. So here's how you set it up. First, activate the glitch that I mentioned at the beginning of the video. Now walk into a horizon queue, and while you're getting lifted up in the air, into your inventory and change your weapon position from 1 to 2. This will give you perfect accuracy mid-air with the weapons that you have equipped. The final step is you need to head to a balloon with horizon. Now have horizon throw the tactical underneath the balloon, enter the lift, and then grab onto the zip line before you're kicked off at the top. Now fly towards a mountain, and once you enter the landing animation, you'll actually get that final kick from the Horizon Tactical. Right when this happens, you should aim down sight at an unsuspecting enemy and take the nastiest trick shot that has ever happened in the history of Apex. And now for a few other little bugs that appear as part of this glitch. If you hold out your Loba bracelet while walking into the Phase Runner at Rift, it will actually glitch your hand and you'll continue inspecting your hand waiting for the bracelet to land even though it never will. You can undo this by healing, but other than that, you're kind of fucked. A lot of the characters can actually use their tacticals while emoting. Oh. If you shoot while emoting, it will silence the weapon on your end. Unfortunately, the enemy can hear the shot. Well, this video has gone on long enough. There's clearly a ton of things that you can do with this glitch. I believe we've only scratched the surface, so feel free to mess around with it yourself. See what you can pull off and tag me if you find anything new or interesting. I hope you enjoyed the video. Have fun out there. And if you're not subscribed, think about it. Have a great day, friend. What in the shit? And you get a heat shield or I'm dead. It's back. I got What is it? I, uh, I really can't describe it. I'm just gonna have to show it to you in a second. <laughs>